Knock it off! You are so annoying. All right, then. I'll solve the zoo mystery your way. Blah, blah, my name is Belson. Bats? Bats are dumb. Grr, I don't care what the answer is. That's you. No, it's not. That's not me. That's it, I'm out of here. Uh... Whoa! Was it nighttime when we went in there? Ah! Uh, the zoo's closed and I'm trapped inside here with you. Just perfect. I know, this is perfect. That we have the whole zoo to ourselves. We can say goodnight to all the animals. Good night, monkeys. Good night, giraffes. Good night, dinosaurs. Leave it to your dumb brain to mistake the worst situation for something fun. That's because it is fun. Ugh, how can you like everything? Well, how do you not like anything? That's not true. I like some things. Really? Like what? None of your business. We were here all day and you didn't like a single solitary animal. That's because the only ones I wanted to see were the dolphins and they weren't even here. <gasps> what the heck are you smiling at? Belson, you just told me something you liked. Yeah, so? So, that's something only buddies do. And buddies always help their buddies. We're gonna track down that dolphin, buddy. And when we do, you're gonna look at her. We can't, the tank's closed, remember? That just means that they're somewhere else. Hmm, we've been everywhere except there. The animal church. Of course, we'll just get over there and we'll check it out. <laughs> hey, what the heck are we? Shh. We gotta get out of here before we get caught. No time for dolphin hunting. No one stops buddies, not even zookeepers. I made a buddy promise and I'm gonna buddy keep it. Zoo powers go, power of snake. Power of monkey. <laughs> Power of spider. Power of kangaroo. Dolphin, it's so cool. I know, buddy. I know. Wow. You want to know why I like everything, Belson? Because everything is like a baby dolphin to me. Yeah, but if everything's a baby dolphin, then the real baby dolphin isn't as special. Yeah, but what if there was, um, think about like a whole planet that's just baby dolphins? That'd be pretty cool. Yeah, I guess that would be pretty cool, buddy. Step away from the tank. He did it! I don't know the guy! He did everything! I didn't want to come here! Oh, I am so sorry. I promise this will never happen again. You guys are in so much trouble. Well, you would be if I hadn't let Brini that sandwich. What? It doesn't matter. Just please, please stay with the group next time. I almost had a heart attack. I was this close to moving to California. It's so cool in California. It's Baker! Zebra stole the key. Clarence figured it out. <gasps> Thanks, buddy. Zoo Powers Bear Hug, go! Oh. All right, Monster Truck fans, all you out there with VIP passes, line up backstage to meet Rake Backburn. Please don't show him your feet. Oh, I wish we had backstage passes. <laughs> Let's see. General admission. Where are they? Oh, no. Uh, I'll be right back. Yeah! Right! <laughs> Did you say something, Chad? Jeff, Sumo, let's see those man traps. Easy. Darling, you look marvelous. <laughs> Glue to man. <laughs> Welcome to the dressing room. <laughs> You better chilly out. <laughs> Why, <Rice> try. <laughs> Pasta la vista, baby. 
I'd like to see that burger getting here now. I think you mean burglar, though. That's what I said. Burger. Like the hamburger. That guy what steals burgers on TV. Well, it's pronounced burglar. But we probably don't have anything to worry about. Except for that guy! Ah! A burger! We should turn off all the lights. Wait, he probably saw us already. We're so dead! Keep it together. This is our time to shine. False alarm, guys. I think it's just Chad. Hey, guys! Wait a minute. If he comes in here, he's gonna set off all the traps. We're gonna kill Chad! No, 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 You got friends over? Don't worry, I won't tell your mom. You just gotta grab something. Teeth sink! Uh-oh, he's trying the back door. Not the poison donuts! Come on, guys. No one's in trouble. I just gotta look for something. Okay, we just gotta get him in and out as fast as possible without setting off any traps. You guys getting in trouble in here? <laughs> I'm hip to it. Trouble? Oh, what? Trouble? Nah, not at all. Whoa, you're just kidding there, little man. Uh, where are those passes? Oh, I know. The bathroom. <gasps> the bathroom! <laughs> Wait, no. I left him in the garage. Oh, no. <laughs> Maybe we're in the bedroom? <laughs> Hello, worm. No. Did I leave him in the kitchen? Or the attic? Oh no. Let's see. Uh, dining room. A dining room? A cellar? A study? A billiard room? There, there. <gasps> Thanks. Wait! No! Stay out of trouble! No! Good job, guys. Nobody died. Hey, almost brought kill you guys. Oh! Oh! Ah. Hey, it worked. <laughs> you, tell the hospital that we're coming. You, open those ambulance doors. Uh... You're gonna be fine, Chad. Clear! <laughs> Get out of here, kid. Give him all the medicine that you got, right into those legs. Chad, you're gonna be just fine. Just don't fall asleep or you'll die. Oh, wow, that guy's really good. Welcome to the clearance show. What do you want to talk about, Mr. Bacon Chips? Talking makes me nervous. Blah. <laughs> Nobody actually laughed. Whoa, what's he doing with that horn? <laughs> oh, he's honking it. <laughs> <laughs> that horn is a killer. I wish I had one, then I could just honk instead of talk. <gasps> I just had the biggest side. One horn, please. Oh, is this for your bike? Nope, it's for my conversation skills. Oh, that's just wonderful. <laughs> I pledge allegiance to the <laughs> the United States of America, and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice. Good morning, students. This is your principal. Just a reminder that the winners of this year's Let's Dis Disease raffle will be announced tomorrow. Good luck on winning the grand prize. Two tickets to Squirty's Moist Mountain Water Park. And now, today's poem. A Fall Day by Mrs. Shoop. The night is crisp. The day is done. Listen to the swaying leaves as they go swish, swish, Clarence, what a witty deconstruction. <laughs> I heard the math quiz got canceled. Yeah! Good thing 
to. I didn't study much. <laughs> I'll see you guys later. Whoa! <laughs> Dog police two. It's the, it's the same as the first one. Should have called it Hot Dog Police One again. <laughs> <laughs> Not funny. Melanie, we've been working together for a couple months now, and I, I think it's time that you. Oh, 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 where'd it go? Where'd it go? Oh, oh, that's right, it's somewhere. Oh. Clarence, the horn is a gimmick. At first, you were just peppering it in, but now you're doing it all the time. People may like it now, but they'll get tired of it very quickly. Can you just stop honking? <laughs> oh, this will never get old. <sighs> Gonna be another honk ridiculous day. Chocolate milk and pickle spears. And now the moment we've all been waiting for. The Let's Dis Disease oh, no. raffle winner. The grand prize winner of the tickets to Squirty's Moist Mountain Water Park is... Number 734-9150-1879. <laughs> <laughs> Come get your prize now, or we're giving it to someone else. Clarence, we've been waiting all week for those results! Just a little honk humor. Come on, guys. What were we talking about? Follow me! Where are we? You'll find out as soon as you turn that frown upside down. Oh, boy. I'm having a wonderful time. Hey, look at that. We're here. Sheep's Bridge? Why did you... How? <laughs> nice job, Clarence! <laughs> oh, he's like little fluffy hot dogs! <laughs> Percy, you're dehydrated. Get some water. Okay. Diff, you see if we can eat these plants. I think these are tubers. And Josh, I want you to find matches. What? I can't find matches out here. Not with that attitude, you can't. I'm gonna go hunt us a elk. What the? Matches? I just don't get it. It's like he's magic or something. <laughs> Everything's going right for him. And when I try my hardest, nothing ever even pans out! That's just Clarence. Uh, where's the bathroom? Hey, you guys! I found a hot tub! <laughs> oh, he's lost it! Ah, not so easy being the leader, huh? I believe him! What? <laughs> Hey guys, hop in, the water's great. It smells like eggs. Why is this here? Come on in, Joshua. Don't you want to relax your tootsies in this nice natural hot tub? No, no, it's not natural. I mean, what is this? Someone hauled a hot tub out here and planted bamboo around it? Who does that? Why not? It's awesome. I'd do it if I had a truck. I'm game. Come on, climb in here, big guy. Take a load off. Look at all those stars, guys. There's so many. And around each one, there's a bunch of planets with some aliens sitting in their alien hot tubs just looking down at us. Hey, guys. You might be right about that, actually, but alien hot tubs would be much more advanced than ours. Yeah, but they're, they're probably not having as much fun as we are. <laughs> right, Joshua? Josh, hello. Hey, buddy. You OK? Josh. Josh. Hello. hello. Hey buddy, hey, buddy. You okay? okay? We'll stay. Um, come again? We'll stay. This could be our spa. Ha! Oh, yes! Oh, oh, uh, yes! And this, this can be my room. And this can be your rooms. Oh, I love it! And this, this can be our kitchen. Who wants pancakes? I don't see a kitchen. And this, can be our ballroom. Oh, how we'll dance. Come on, guys. The next dance is 
Mr. Conga! Ah! Oh, no, I'll get you! <laughs> Guys, help me. Throw down a rope or something. Don't worry, Joshua. We'll save you. Jeff, throw him a rope. Uh, we don't have a rope. Excuse me, Dosh. The adults need to talk for a moment. Oh, no, what do we do? 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 We could make a human chain. That's right. Human chain. 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 Do not do a human chain. I said no human chain. I changed my mind. Clarence, no more human chain. Oh! I'm gonna die! No! No! I'm scared. Don't worry, Josh. Nature Kate says that if you just believe in nature, then nature will... What? What's with all that crud on your face? This crud is my face, Jeff. Or at least the ghost of faces past. I don't know what you're talking about, but you better wash it off and come back to class, or Mrs. Baker's gonna be really mad. Also, we have to do this vision test thing, even though I think it's really pointless. So Sumo and I picked you for our group. Vision? I'm afraid that chapter of my life has come to a close. Uh-huh. Come on, Clarence. I don't want to get in trouble. <laughs> Where are you, Jeff? Clarence, we got to go back. <laughs> stop, stop <gasps> it. You can't catch me. Clarence! <laughs> Clarence, stop! <laughs> Clarence, you're going to get us in trouble. <laughs> Walk the dog! <laughs> No, you are going to wear a shirt like a normal uh, human being. No, I'm not going to wear hey my shirt. Whoa. What are you guys doing? They're setting up in the gym for the Vision Bee. I signed our team up as Sumo and the Laser Twins. Sumo, you're a sound for sore ears. Oh, jeez. See, Clarence, you got to wash off the mud or else our team is going to lose. If only it were that simple, Jeff. It is that simple. <laughs> Don't you see, man? He just wants to be treated like you or I. How can you talk to this poor, poor little boy like that? What's that? Oh, uh, Sumo. What? I'm not gonna be on your team if you guys won't take it seriously. Jeff, I can't see your betrayal, but my heart still feels the sting. All right, I'm gonna see if it's not too late to switch teams. I'm done with this nonsense. I'm not here to make friends, guys. I'm here to win. Um, <laughs> Don't listen to him, child. Sumo and the Laser Twins will never fail. You hear me? Sumo and the Laser Twins will never fail! H O Z C E Z R. Please read the next line. Uh, H O W C E. E. That's 60 points for Team Belson. <laughs> Nailed it. Okay, up next we have Sumo and the Laser Twins. All right, let's do this. Hooray! Oh my. Sumo, where's the rest of your team? Okay, you're missing a member. You gotta have three, hun. Uh, yeah, I don't know where Jeff is, but I can just read it for him or something. Okay, if all the members of your vision team don't compete, you're automatically disqualified. Okay, please exit the stage so another group can have their fun. I'm sorry, child. It looks like the end for us. Aww. <gasps> What? What's going on? What's going on? Where is it? I'm told you've lost your sight, child. Yes. Yes, I have. The doctors said this boy will never see again. That's right, never again. Well, I've got something right here which will cure this ailment of yours and restore your sight. Dr. Jeff's famous Alexa. Oh, feel its curing properties. Uh, okay, great. You boys can get off the stage now. Can you feel it? Yes, I can feel it. Can you feel it curing you? Yes. It's just wire. Say it with me now. I will see again. I, I will see again. I will see again. I will see again. Yes, yeah, yeah. I will see again.
site in question, I was out to... So this guy is the same guy as before, right? That's a key witness. And is he the one that wants to build the factory, or is he trying to stop the factory from being built? Just pay attention to the trial, and it'll make sense! I'm trying! Did you or did you not meet with Mr. Robofrog on October 24th? Well, I... I don't know. Huh? Your Honor, I would like you to be struck from the record where I lost my temper back there! Um, I gotta go wash my hands. Okay, just wash your hands after. Hey, Sumo, I got the hovercraft lady. Ah, oh, cool. How'd you get it out without messing up the box? Don't you worry your bald little head, Sumo. I have my Twix. Yep, everything went swimmingly. Now let's fly this hog before Jeff notices we're gone. All right, here goes. <gasps> oh, grapes. Well, I hope you've learned a valuable lesson from RoboFrog. Your illegal factory may have generated as much in excessium as you could want, but at the cost of something even more important. Your friends. And now look at you. Your friends have left you all alone. <sighs> Wait a minute. Where are my friends? Okay, shouldn't be too bad. Just put the head back on. Sumo, Clarence? Uh-oh. Oh, there you are. I've been thinking, and you were right. We should play with my Ginspot. No, no, that's okay. Really, we're good. Nonsense. I'll go grab it now, and we can... What did you say, Clarence? Take it out for a spin. Be right back. <laughs> Jeff, hold on! Jeff, I'm hungry. Sumo, come on, not now. No, Jeff, I'm really hungry. Like, I might pass out if I don't eat. Oh, okay. I mean, I guess I could go see what I have in the kitchen. Yeah, hurry up, I'm feeling woozy. Okay. I bought you some time. Now go fix that toy. No problem. All right. Nice and careful. Ugh. Oh, no, that didn't work at all. <laughs> okay, 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 I can fix it. I can fix it. Mm. So it is. Well, let's take a look. Eee. There, a perfect peanut butter sandwich. Yeah, I can't eat this. I'm allergic to peanuts. But you just said you wanted peanut butter. I did not. I said I wanted rice butter. Rice butter? Is that like rice milk? Yes, except butter. Interesting. I don't think I've ever had rice butter before, but it sounds delicious. I bet we have some around here somewhere. Do people make it? Sumo! Uh, hey, Jeff, maybe you should go look around for a rice butter churner thing. Oh, okay. I'll be right back. Then we should open the Gins bar already. What the heck happened, man? I thought you were going to glue the head on. Oh, glue. You gotta tell Jeff the truth. I'm sure he'll understand. I can fix it still. You just need to stall him for a little bit longer. Guys, who was copying my toy box? Jeff, Jeff, wait. Don't jump to any conclusions. Let me explain. It's a crazy story. Really funny, actually. You see, I was going to the bathroom, and I heard a strange noise come from your room. So I ran in there, and there was this, um, raccoon. And he just came through your window, and he was going to break your toy. He didn't say that or anything, but I could just see it in his eyes. And then he just broke, and I said, no, bad boy. You put that back before death finds out. But you know raccoons, they can't fix anything. They're not beavers. So I guess what I'm trying to say is, here you go. You're welcome. That's what happened, right, Sumo? Nah. Does Jeff like me? Aw, uh, it says maybe. Aw, uh, forget about him. He's not that cute anyway. Um, excuse me, lady friends. Are you guys talking about this Jeff? <laughs> yeah, she really likes him. I do not. I just think he's nice and a little bit cute. Do you know him or something? Yeah, he's my best friend, and we eat lunch every day, and you should call him on the phone. He'd love talking on the phone. I don't know. The origami says he might not like me. Here, I'll do it for you. Five, 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 zero, one, zero, one. No! Hello? You take it! No, no way! You have, you to, have talk. to talk! This is like your you car. You gotta do it. Yeah. Let me talk. Good evening! Hello, Jeff! Yes? Hi, this is... What was your name again? Melissica. This is Melissica. I just wanted to say that I think you are a real upstanding gent. <laughs> oh 
my gosh, Melastica likes me. But something sounded off. All right, buddy. I just wish Clarence was here to see this. <laughs> How did you do that? That was awesome. Do you girls want to have some real fun? I need to call her back. I have to tell her I love no, her. No, man, it's too soon. Too soon. <laughs> always says if you love someone, you call them back immediately. No, that's wrong. You'll freak her out. Well, Clarence says... Clarence isn't here. He's at that stupid slumber party. Yeah, it is stupid. I bet he's having so much fun over there. Yeah, baking cookies. And probably knitting or some dumb. Yeah, trying on outfits, doing each other's nails. Talking about their feelings. And having dumb pillow fights. Uh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I've had this much fun at a slumber party ever! Me neither! I just wish I talked to Jack when I had the chance. Oh well. <gasps> no. Not oh well. You still have the chance. Did I say oh well when I dropped my cubby worms in your driveway? No. I said oh yes. And I picked those babies right up and I shared them with you guys. Did Columbus say oh well when he couldn't discover Indiana and he landed his plane in Canada instead? No, he said, oh, maybe. And he put that flag down and he marched right up to the courthouse and he made that bill a law. Uh, Clarence? Uh... Oh, yes. That's why you ladies can vote to this very day. So let's stop saying our oh wells and start saying our oh, let's go to justice already. <laughs> yeah, let's do it! <laughs> It's the new kids to do song. It's not even that bad. Yeah, I'm feeling it. Oh, great. Sumo and Jeff are still having a wild bro party in the dude cave. Throwing down like they always do. You have to put your hands like this. Let's go back to my place and hit each other with sticks. I can do the work of two normal guys. Oh, dang it, Clarence. If you're not going to help build a boat, just get out of here. <sighs> Jeff, Sumo hates me now. I'm sure he doesn't mm -hmm. hate. Sorry I yelled at you the other day. I was just frustrated. That's okay. So do you want to go to the movies with me and Jeff tomorrow? We're going to go see the RoboFrog movie. Nah. <laughs> I think I got to keep working on my boat. Mm -hmm. I really need to finish my boat. Are you up there, Santa Claus? Oh, there you are. Well, Santa, I'm just worried about my friend from school, Sumo. He's just been acting like a really crazy guy. He could yell at me, and I think that the boat he's building is just driving him crazy. So, can you make sure that he just finishes it and that we can just be friends again? Thanks, Santa. Also, can you tell Mom to let me go see RoboFrog with Jeff tomorrow? Oh, oh come on, you stinking thing. What you building there, Noah? It's a boat. You do know you're about 30 to 40 miles from the nearest body of water, don't you? Yeah, so? Well, shoot. Maybe it'll flood and you'll be the only one above water. What do you say about that? What? I don't know. <laughs> well, don't catch cold out here. Some help? 
Because you got some. We're going to stay right here and build all night until your dream boat is a real boat. We're gonna get this thing in the water. I'll take you guys, but mostly just to watch you sink. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Ahoy there, mateys. <laughs> it's time to sail to seven seas. Okay, let's go. Guys, I think we should review our boating safety protocol. Deaf pirates live dangerously. That's why they only got one eye, duh. Ah! Let's boat! <laughs> Oh, dang it. Come, Come on, Clarence, jump! Oh my gosh, I can't believe we did it! We're on the boat, we're on the boat! Hoist the sails! You did it, buddy! You did it! Hooray for sumo! Hooray for sumo! I did it! Yeah, that's what we're saying. I did it! I did it! My boat worked! <laughs> the thing I want most in life is a boat. You don't need a boat all the time, unless you live in it or something. But when you're out there in the water, a boat will keep you from going under. <laughs> so, I built a boat. I don't have a lot of things in our mind. Sometimes things are really hard for me. It's not perfect, but it's my boat. And I love it. There's a dollar hidden in the yard, and whoever finds it gets to keep it. Any questions? Where's my mom? Who? Oh, um, bus? Uh, home? Nobody knows the true worth of a man. Clarence, these kids look like they might sue us. We should have them sign waivers. Nah, these kids have kind faces. The kind that I trust for no good reason. Besides, this is the best turnout we've had in years. But the Clarence group has never done this before. Ladies and gentlemen, start your engines. If we find the money, who gets to keep it? You do. Why? Because it's fun. Life is but a dance of triumph and tragedy. Sir, you can dance. Let the dollar hunt begin! Is there a volume knob on this thing? Oh, turn it off. Harry, turn it off! Come on, you gotta sit on it. Let the hunt begin! Oh, 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 hi! Hey! Huh? Oh. No, get, get, no! Oh, yeah, Simo's in charge of creating obstacles. Okay, buddy, just, just breathe. Six step for Tyrannus! Oh, please, lost bus? That's right, buddy. Just keep looking for that dollar. Clarence! Uh, 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 come on. Don't forget, I'm making casserole for my book club tonight. Mom, look, the dollar hunt is a huge success. Everyone's having a great time. Give it to me. Yep. Uh, Clarence, hello. I'm leaving to get my hair done now. Do you still have that $20 bill I gave you for groceries? Way ahead of you, Mom. I got the list right here and the $20 right here. Ooh. All right, that's good, sweetheart. I'm depending on you. Love you, bye. I gotta go. Love you, bye. Ah, oh, jeez. Jeff? Yeah? You remember that $1 bill that I said I buried? What did you do? Well, I might have sort of buried a $20 bill instead. You mean the one your mom gave you to buy groceries to make a casserole for a book club tonight while she's getting her hair done? Yep, that's the one. Don't tell anyone. We can still switch it back. Don't tell anyone what? That I buried a $20 bill instead of a $1 bill. Oops. You didn't hear that. $20? Hot oh, dog! 20, oh. $20, tis my destiny. Ah, ah. Oh, 20, oh. $20, Wait, no. Wait, no. Everybody stop the hunt. Stop the hunt. Unfortunately, the rules say the hunt can only stop when the money is found. Who made these horrible rules? Oh, uh, well, that doesn't matter because you know where the money is, right? Um... Right? Clarence? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> yeah! The already is upon us! Ha! Ah! Oh! Oh! Eggs. 
feathers. Don't tell me you can't remember where you hid the money. Okay, I won't. Eggs. Clarence, poop. a mother's trust More poop. is a secret bond. You can't fail her. Retrace your steps. No. Retrace them in your mind. My mind? <laughs> No! You're a cute little dickens, aren't you, Salami Me? Hey, Clarence, what you doing in there, buddy? Nothing! Run! Stop making sense, making so- <laughs> ah! Oh, that's it. I know where it is now. I buried it over by the tree! <laughs> <laughs> is it a cat burglar? Or a dog burglar? Or a kissing bandit? It's a mountain lion. <gasps> really? This isn't a pink mountain lion lisping about stage left. This is a wild, vicious animal. A few years ago, a mountain lion wandered into a neighborhood just like this. Let's just say it wasn't pretty. What well, wasn't pretty? The mountain lion? <laughs> uh, are you crying? Home! <laughs> now! All right, who wants second breakfast? <laughs> Is that the mountain lion? No, it's too weird. Raccoons! It's trees! Scary! Come on! Uh. Don't follow us, Lucy, and stay here! Randy, Randy, it's too dangerous! Don't help us! What? After I hit the mountain lion with the tranquilizer dart, move in with the net. But why don't we just talk to the mountain lion instead? You can't talk to a wild animal. I'm sorry, Clarence. It's the only way. Oh, okay. Well, I'm sorry too, cause... Hmm? Hey, mountain lion, run! Ah, snap. Gotta get them down before they touch those power lines. Wait, don't shoot. I know what to do. Hello, mountain lion. It's you, myself, the mountain lion. I am the mountain lioniest mountain lion. The best there ever was or will be. My mom was a mountain and my dad was a lion. And that pretty much gives me superpowers. But most importantly, I don't want to hurt any nice raccoon. I just want to go home. <laughs> Dang. All clear. Ha! Huh? 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 You did it! <laughs> I'm sorry, raccoon friends, but you're safe now. And maybe when you wake up, you can forgive me and we can be best friends. Yeah. Look, kid, I found you something. Wow, old wet comics. Lucene, you shouldn't have. Well, you've always been very supportive of the Bureau of Sanitation. Thanks, Lucene, but I'm still worried about my little guys. Hey, don't touch those raccoons, they might have rabies. <gasps> oh, rabies hands, rabies hands. Randy, Randy, get it off, get it off. <laughs> Are you gonna be okay? Not if they have rabies. Rise and shine, lazy bones. Uh, five more minutes. Okay, but I'm making egg salad. <laughs>